The movement of electrons along a path creates an electrical current. We use electric currents to power many appliances in our lives. Most modern devices are capable of using electrical energy and converting it into other forms of useful energy, such as heat energy, light energy, and sound energy. Heat energy, or thermal energy, is the result of the vibrating motion of particles. Heat energy can be transferred from warmer objects, objects with more particle motion energy, to cooler objects, objects with less particle motion. Heat can be produced in a number of different ways. Some examples of this are rubbing two things together to produce friction, when energy changes forms, when a chemical reaction takes place. Conduction is a transfer of heat energy and electric charge. The wires found in many devices we use allow for conduction to take place. Heat energy affects the states of matter. At high temperatures, the particles will move faster and spread out in a gaseous state. At lower temperatures, the particles will move more slowly and remain closer to one another in a liquid state. Finally, at the lowest temperatures, particles become tightly packed to one another and barely move in a solid state. Light is a form of energy that can be seen by the eye. Some sources of light also release heat, like the sun. Light moves in a straight line in all directions, but when it reaches an object, it bounces off or becomes absorbed by the objects. Objects that absorb light appear to be dark, while objects that reflect a lot of light appear to be bright. Light may take different paths depending on the way it interacts with surfaces. Reflection is a change in direction of light bouncing off a surface, like a lake. Refraction is the bending of light rays as they pass through different substances at an angle. When light strikes an object, most of the light is reflected and we're able to see its source when light from it enters our eyes. Translucent objects allow some light to pass through them, often creating a very faint shadow, like a diamond. Opaque objects don't allow light to pass through and often result in strong shadows, like rocks. Transparent objects allow most of the light to pass through them and barely form a shadow, like clear glass. Sound is a form of energy that can be heard. It is a transfer of energy in the form of waves produced from rapidly vibrating particles in a given substance. The amplitude or size of a wave determines how high a sound is. The frequency at which a wave is emitted determines its pitch. There are different types of musical instruments, such as string, percussion, and wind instruments that sound when vibrations are produced in them. We're able to speak because our vocal cords vibrate inside our throat. We can hear sound when our ears capture incoming sound waves. Sound waves can travel in all directions, but only when matter is present. As sound waves travel through different substances or travel further away, sound travels slowly through gases, more quickly through liquids, and very quickly through solids. All the energy we use is mainly obtained from the burning of fossil fuels. These processes generate air, light, and sound pollution. This is why we have to make a conscious effort to both reduce the amount of energy we waste as well as look for other, cleaner alternatives of obtaining energy.